In this video, I'll demonstrate how to easily enable customer reviews for the products in your Shopify store. Displaying product reviews in your online store will not only boost credibility and trust, but can also increase conversions and sales. On Shopify, we can easily collect, manage, and display customer reviews on our product pages with just a few clicks. Not only can customers leave star ratings and written reviews, but also images and videos showing off your product after their purchase. Enabling product reviews allows you to collect valuable customer feedback and adds a level of professionalism to your online store. So let's head over to Shopify and go over how to enable customer reviews for the products in your online store. But before we get started, if you haven't joined Shopify yet, simply scan the QR code on the screen or click the link in the video description to unlock your free trial. If you're looking to launch an e-commerce store, Shopify is definitely the most popular and in my opinion, the best platform you could use to build your online business. No credit card is required to start your free trial. And if you like it, which I bet you will, you can select a pricing plan that best suits the size and stage of your business. So if you're ready to take the plunge and launch your own e-commerce store, go ahead and scan the QR code on the screen or click the link in the video description to try Shopify for free. So once you get to Shopify, go ahead and log in. This should take you to your Shopify account dashboard. So to add reviews to our online store, the first thing we'll have to do is install a reviews app. Shopify used to have a built-in product review app, but it's been discontinued, so now we'll have to use a third-party app from the Shopify App Store. So to search the Shopify App Store, let's start by clicking the Apps tab on the left-hand side menu here. This will open up a menu where you can view the apps that you currently have installed and where you can search for apps in the Shopify App Store. So to find a Reviews app for our online store, let's type in Reviews in the search bar up top here. I currently don't have any Reviews apps installed for my online store. So let's click the option at the bottom here that says search reviews in Shopify App Store. And of course, this will take us over to the Shopify App Store. Since we search for reviews, it should display all the different apps that are related to that keyword. As you can see, there are tons of apps available and more are constantly being added. If you like, feel free to check out the various reviews apps. But when selecting an app, I recommend you select one that's built for Shopify. So for this example, we're going to be taking a look at the top rated product reviews app, which is the Judge Me app. This is a 5 star rated app with over 40,000 reviews. So to check it out, let's click it to open it up. This will open up a page where you can view all the details and information about the app. With the Judge Me app, you can collect unlimited product reviews, get photo and video reviews automatically, and showcase ratings on Google and social media to reach more shoppers. Your rating sections are fully customizable, and there are tons of other widgets and features that you can add as well. And for pricing, there's a forever free plan with unlimited reviews and review requests, unlimited photo and video reviews, and much more. And if you need even more tools and features, you can upgrade to the awesome plan for only $15 a month. So to add the Judge Me app to your Shopify store, go ahead and click the install button on the left hand side here. You'll then be taken to a screen where you can verify the app access. If everything looks good, go ahead and click the install button at the bottom right. And the Judge Me app should now be added to your Shopify dashboard. From the menu on the left hand side, you should now see the Judge Me Reviews app in the app section. So when you first install the Judge Me app, you should see the setup screen here. Go ahead and select your settings language, the language for your widgets and emails, and also the theme you want to install the Judge Me app to. For this example, I'm just going to install it to my current theme. Once you're finished, go ahead and click the Start Setup button at the bottom right. Here's where we can start setting up the various features and widgets to display customer reviews. For the first step here, we have to enable App Embed. This is needed for reviews to show properly in your online store. So to enable App Embed, let's click the button here. This should open up a new tab that takes us over to the Shopify editor. And we should see here that the Judge Me app has now been embedded and activated. Now that we've embedded the app, we should be able to start adding our review widgets. But before you continue, make sure you click the Save button at the top right. And all of my changes should now be saved. Now that we've embedded the app, let's go back to the Settings tab. And the button here should now say App Embed Enabled. Let's click Continue at the bottom right to go to the next step. And here's where we can install the review widget. This is a customizable widget that will allow you to start displaying reviews on your product pages. So to install the review widget, let's click the button here. This will open up our Shopify theme editor in a new tab, and we should see the reviews widget added to the menu on the left hand side. From here, we can edit our review widget and adjust where it's displayed on our product page. When you first add the reviews widget, it'll be displayed at the bottom of your product page. 
You can move it around if you like, but I think leaving it at the bottom is best, especially after you get a ton of customer reviews. So now that we've added our review widget, let's click the save button at the top right. And my review widget has been saved. Let's head back over to the review zap setup tab. It should now say widget block installed, and we can now move on to the next step where we can install the star ratings badge. Adding a star ratings badge will allow you to easily display your product ratings underneath your product titles. So to install our star ratings, let's click the button here. This should open up the Shopify theme editor in a new tab, and from the menu on the left hand side, you should now see the star ratings tab. Your star ratings will be added to the bottom of your product information section, but you can easily move it around by dragging the tab here. For example, if I wanted to move my star ratings right underneath my title, I can simply click and drag it all the way up to my desired location. And my star ratings will now be displayed underneath my titles. So before you continue, make sure you click the save button. And star ratings have now been added to my product pages. Let's head back over to the review app tab and continue the setup. The widget block has now been installed and we can now continue to the next step. Here's where you can set up your branding. To change your star color, simply click the icon here and you can select whatever color you wish. For my stars, I think I'll go with this color here. Also, there's a section where you can add your store logo, which you can add if you haven't already uploaded it to your store. But once you're finished, go ahead and click the continue button at the bottom right. This will take us to the last step of the setup process where we can add our automatic review requests. With this enabled, review request emails will automatically be sent to customers after they place an order. Using the fields here, we can adjust the timing of when the emails are sent. Using the first field here, you can adjust the amount of days until the email is sent for domestic orders, and using the next field, you can adjust the amount of days for international orders. Keep in mind, this will depend on your location and your shipping speed. Also, we can easily change or update anything we like in the settings later. So once you've selected the number of days for your automatic review requests, go ahead and click the finish button at the bottom right. And voila, you've just set up the Judge Me Reviews app for your Shopify store. You can now collect reviews and display them for your products. So now that we've installed the Judge Me Reviews app, let's check it out and see what all it can do. So to explore the Judge Me app, let's start by clicking the button here. And this will take us to a page where you'll be able to view your review insights. This includes your review requests sent, reviews over time, your average rating, your trust scores, and even your top products and recent activity. So that's an overview of your review insights page. Now let's go to the next tab here where we can manage our reviews. This should take you to your reviews dashboard where you can view and manage all the reviews that you receive. Not only will you be able to manage your reviews, but also import reviews and track your review requests. If you wanted to import reviews from another platform, simply click the import reviews button here. This will open up a page where you can view all the various platforms that you can import your reviews from. There are tons of platforms that you can import your reviews from, and even e-commerce platforms like Amazon and Etsy. To import reviews, you'll first have to export them from the other platform using a CSV file. And at the bottom here, we can also sync our reviews with our shop app, Google Shopping, Meta, and our TikTok shop. And this is a super useful feature, especially if you already sell on another platform. We'll come back here after we add an example review to my store. But for now, let's go to the left hand side menu here and go to the collect reviews tab. Here's where you can track your automatic review requests and if you like, schedule requests manually as well. We just installed the Judge Me app so we don't have any review requests yet, but we'll be able to see them all here once they start rolling in. And from the schedule and reminders tab, we can adjust the timing of our review requests for domestic and international orders. And from the email templates tab, we can view the review requests that will be sent to the customer after they place their order. If you like, you can edit the default template here or click the create template button to create a new template. If we click the edit button for the default template, it'll open up a menu where we can easily customize our template however we like. Feel free to edit your template and adjust your settings, but for now, I'm just gonna leave mine as is. But now when a customer places an order in my online store, they'll receive this email to leave a review after about 15 days. When the customer clicks it, they'll be taken to a page where they can leave their product review. The customer can leave their star rating, a review title, and write their review. Once they're finished, they can click the submit review button, and they'll then be taken to another page where they can add a photo or a video of your product. Written reviews are great for boosting conversions, but video and photo reviews are even better. This isn't the same shirt, but it'll work for this example. And once the customer finishes uploading their optional photo or video, they can go down to the bottom here and click the submit review button. 
and the customer review has now been added to my online store. Also, if a customer visits your product page, they can scroll down to your review widget and click the write a review button to leave a review from here as well. The process to leave a review is similar to the email where they can leave a star rating, add a review title, add the review description, and upload an optional photo or video. They can then enter their name and their email and click the submit review button. And the review will then be added to your online store. So let's refresh the page here and check it out. As you can see, it now shows my product has one five star review. And if we scroll down to our review widget, we can see the star rating, the review description, and the photo. As you collect more reviews for your product, you'll be able to view them all here. So let's head back over to our Shopify dashboard and go to the Judge Me Reviews tab on the left hand side to get to the Judge Me Reviews Insights menu. Now if we take a look at my insights, we can see it shows I have one review with an average rating of 5. And since that's my only review so far, it made the hat one of my top products. And I can also view the review in my recent activity. So now that my store has an example review, let's head back over to the Manage Reviews tab and see what we can do. From here, you'll be able to view and manage all the reviews that you receive. We can see all the review information, such as the customer, when it was created, the rating, and the current status. Currently, my review is published, but if we click the drop down menu here, we can hide the review and select a reason. And if we click the icon here, we can share our review on social media, ask the customer to update the review, archive the review, edit the review, or see all the review details. And if you needed to export or import reviews, you could use the buttons up top here. So we've gone over how to install and configure the Reviews app, and how to collect and manage reviews. But one of the things that makes the Judge Me Reviews app so popular is that they have tons of cool widgets that we can install as well. To check out the widgets, let's check out the Widgets tab from the menu on the left hand side. And here's where you can install and customize several widgets that are available with the Judge Me Reviews app. We've already installed the Review widget, which allows us to collect and display reviews on our product pages and our star rating badge to show the average rating of our products and how many reviews they have. But we can also add other widgets, like a reviews carousel where we can showcase our best reviews, pop-up reviews to highlight top reviews, review snippets for social proof, a Q&A section so customers can ask questions about your products, an all reviews page that shows all your reviews on a dedicated page, a floating reviews tab which adds a reviews tab to the side of your page, judge me medals and badges, a verified reviews counter to show your number of verified reviews, an all reviews counter to show the total number of published reviews, a UGC media grid to show your favorite content, and a customer accounts widget where customers can write and view reviews and see rewards on their order confirmation page. So feel free to check out and install whichever widgets you like for your online store. And once you're finished, you'll have an upgraded Shopify store that's ready to collect and display customer reviews. So that's a quick overview of how to easily enable customer reviews in your Shopify store. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.